Personal flotation devices, also known as PFDs or life jackets, have the potential to save lives. As such, the U.S. Coast Guard requires PFDs on board all vessels. When choosing a PFD, it is important to ensure that it can support the size and weight of the intended wearer and is approved by the U.S. Coast Guard. Several types of PFDs exist. Let's take a moment to discuss these various types and the different qualities they possess. For example, a Type 1 or offshore life jacket is suited for all waters, especially open, rough, or remote waters where a rescue can easily be delayed. An adult-sized Type 1 PFD will provide the wearer with 22 pounds of buoyancy and 11 pounds of buoyancy in children's sizes. This type of PFD will turn unconscious wearers to a face-up position. A disadvantage with this type of PFD is that it is large and awkward, making it more difficult for the wearer to swim. The Type 2 or Near Shore Life Jacket is best suited to calm, inland water where there is a good chance of an easy rescue. An adult-sized Type 2 PFD will provide 15 pounds of buoyancy and 11 pounds of buoyancy in children's sizes. However, a drawback to this type of PFD is that it may not turn some unconscious wearers face up. Similar to the Type 2, the Type 3 PFD, or flotation aid, is also best worn on calm, inland waters where there is a good chance of an easy rescue and is therefore not best suited for coastal waters. Some examples of this type of PFD are float coats, fishing vests, and water sport vests. An adult-sized PFD will provide 15 pounds of buoyancy and 11 pounds of buoyancy in children's sizes. Once again, this type of PFD will also not turn unconscious wearers to a face-up position. A few examples of the Type 4 or throwable devices are cushions, ring buoys, and horseshoe buoys and are only intended to be used in calm inland water with heavy boat traffic where help is close by and always available. The Type 4 is designed to be thrown to a person who may have fallen into the water and held until rescued as opposed to worn. Deck suits, work vests, and board sailing vests are examples of the Type 5 special use device. These are often designed for specific tasks or activities. For example, some Type 5s are designed for cooler climates and provide hypothermia protection. In other instances, some Type 5s are only approved when worn. It is important to check the approval conditions found on the label before using such a device.